Over the past week, I've been testing out this Miele Blizzard CX1 Excellence Powerline Bagless Cylinder Vacuum Cleaner. It has so many different features, including bagless cleaning. To open it up, it usually needs. There we go. The whole back bit comes off. Dust gathers right inside here, you simply pop it open and throw it in the bin. It has a HEPA filter which is to remove allergens and dust. It has a retractable cord, so you pull it out as far as you need. It's six and a half meters in total and then you simply press this button here and it pulls the cord back in tidily for you afterwards. Right so to actually use this vacuum you use this part here with a telescopic tube which can be shortened and lengthened so you simply use this part here and you push or pull to get the desired length that you want for easy vacuuming. You have this button right here where you can change use to show this side. So when you press it This kind of hard brushy material comes out which is ideal for hard floors. We mainly have carpet so I haven't actually had to use that feature. So you simply click it back into place and so now it's ready to hoover the carpet. There are four different dials on, on here for different types of carpet like um, long pile, short pile. The hoover itself is actually really quiet. Simply press this button to turn it on. So it's nowhere near as loud as most. It is, however, very powerful. So it can be quite hard to push across the carpet. But I do find that that it really just pick up and make the carpet so much cleaner. Turn it back off. Right, so by turning it turning it off like that, it's more of a pause according to the instruction leaflet. And it does need to be unplugged from the power supply after every use. There is also a comfort clean feature. I haven't quite figured out exactly what it does, but while the hoover is still turned on, if you press that, it it makes some strange noises inside, and I'm guessing that it's just cleaning the inside of the filters and stuff. I love that there are little compartments where you can keep the little extras in so that you don't lose any extra pieces and parts that come with it. So everything is all kept together. I have to say I would definitely recommend this. Obviously the suction power is very high so if you do struggle to vacuum then it might not be for you but if you want a powerful vacuum cleaner that really does work then this is a really good one. I will put a link in the description below so you can have a look for yourself on the website um, but it should be easily found on the AO.com website. Thank you for watching.